white trash and blue collar But I could change all that if I had a couple million dollars Good morning everybody, it's your boy Matt um, And me And my little brother AKA Slayer what? Slayer 101 22 Slayer 101 22 um, we're doing a front view today because I want you to see all the magnificent deer like this one on the side of the road. Yeah. And those over there. Either way, um, there's a couple things I want to talk about today. Well, no, one thing I want to talk about today. We got a puppy. No, they already know that. Oh. Um. It's a puppy. No. They already know about it. Everybody know. told them about it. Um, <laughs> I want to do uh, basically talk about the fact that about you actually, and the fact that I am very proud of the fact that you are an ROTC. Thank you. And the fact that you are a tech sergeant. Same which, as our grandfather. Same, well, not just that. I mean, I'm. I guarantee you, pops would have been happy about that. Yeah. Um, the fact that no doubt about it. The fact that you're what one of the top kids in your class, your your platoon, yeah. your flight. I'm I'm actually one of the highest ranking. I'm actually the third, the the fourth highest ranking officer in our class. Yeah. Which is and well, that's pretty freaking of AS, outstanding. Of my AS two, out of all AS twos in my class, which is for any aerospace you, science two. If for any of you who know that, I I just know that he's one of the fourth highest. He's the fourth highest rank in his class. That I'm freaking astound, astonished by that. Yeah, of my sophomore class. Of, of his sophomore. sophomore class in high school. Yeah. And you keep your ranks when you cross over to next year, don't you? Yes, but I'm gonna have to be in COTS if I'm gonna become an officer. Do do COTS? Yeah, I am. Oh look, the Nitto truck. Nitto truck. Nitto off-road tires. Yeah. Anyways, yeah, but that's one of the things I want to talk about. I'm super freaking proud of him. I mean, there, Quentin, there are no no words that can describe how proud I am of you. Thank you. The fact that you found something you love to do you. and you excel at it, that that's just astounding. You know? Okay. Um, another thing I want to talk to you guys about is uh, we got a call from the guy last week who's working on my truck. He's been an exceptional worker. He's been going in on the week on his uh, days off on the weekends and working on it. He's uh, he's pretty much done all out. He's gone all out on this truck on my truck. Yeah, I actually had a dream one night where you got where your where your truck was being worked on by a professional racer. I wouldn't be surprised. No, I mean like the most the most famous professional racer ever. Oh, yeah, no. And and he actually yeah. and he actually let you ride race in one of his race cars. I've actually been in a NASCAR. But yeah. you didn't know that. No, I didn't. Yeah. Either way, I mean, yeah, I'm just I'm super um, stoked about that. I mean, I just, I can't. Damn, I mean, that's crazy. Hmm. You know? Because it, it's not very often that... I mean, customer service is one thing. But that's like over-the-top customer service, you know? Mm-hmm. It's crazy. I mean, it... Yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm probably gonna... Ah, oh, shit. I'll probably cut this little clip here and see you guys in about less than a nanosecond because I last thing I think you guys want to be doing is sitting here staring at the back of this Tahoe. So I'll see you guys here. Or as what we called it when we were young, taco. No, you called it a taco. I called it. Yeah, but either way, so I will see you guys here in a second. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that second there. Or, well, for us it was about 10 minutes because we were stuck in traffic. Yeah. Uh, when I move out of my parents' house, I am definitely moving farther north because I do not like being out. Well, don't move, don't move too far away from us because I would like to visit you every once. Well, in a while. no, I know that. I mean, 
I just don't want to live in the city because the city's coming out towards the house and I don't like it. Yeah, <clears throat> yeah so I live I in live in. Uh, why don't you live? I want to live in Bernie. Comfort. Yeah, there you go. Comfort. Well, no, I want to live in Bernie. Yeah, Bernie. Bernie is a very old-fashioned town. Love it, by the way. Yeah. That's why Skyler probably wants to move out there because there's a lot of older cars. No, it's quieter. Quieter, man. I like quiet, Quentin. Same. I'm not one of those people that likes to listen to their music full blast. Where oh, other like people our neighborhood? Hear. Yeah. I wouldn't mind living in. Yeah. I just want to live in a neighborhood where I can, where I've got enough land, or I want to live on a property where I have enough land. Where if I want to go shoot guns, I just can go into my backyard, load a gun, or go into my house, load a gun, go in the backyard and shoot it. And not have to worry about the police. Yeah. That's what I want to do. Yeah. There is a lot of freaking Teslas out on the road today. Yeah. I've seen like three or four of them already. I, I don't get the deal with Teslas. I, I really don't. They're I, electric cars, and electric cars I know, don't get I, that well. That get, don't get that much mileage. I charge. dude, electric char, elect the electric car, it, 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 yeah, it does. It does. Yeah, they're pretty freaking. They last a long freaking time. But not as long as gas. Um, yeah, not as long as you could definitely go farther in a gas vehicle. But you know what? You could go even farther in a diesel vehicle. Yeah, diesels. Diesels are the most. Are if you're ever gonna go for very few. If you're ever going to go on a long distance trip, use a diesel. Yeah, it, it might cost you more in fuel, but but it's going to last you longer too. Yeah. So if you had a, so if you're going from from the bottom of Texas to the top to the straight up nah, to the top little, to our border of Canada, you probably wouldn't have to fill as, fill up as much as a electric or a gas. No, dude, electric wouldn't even make it. Yeah. Electrics, but yeah, um, yeah, but you would have to stop a lot less than the gas power, regular gas power. Yeah. You have to stop to get gas a lot less. And what a gas power, I mean, diesel. Well, I mean, it depends, it depends if you're hauling something. Yeah, if you're just like not loaded down and there's like very little wind. And you're driving a diesel truck with full tank of diesel. I mean, you f fuck you. You won't have to fill up that much. I mean, we, I might be exaggerating a little bit, but yeah, you won't have to fill up that freaking much. That pole, right at the arrow. That that left arrow. Yep. Yes. Stuck at another freaking light. <clears throat> what are the odds? Yep. <clears throat> what are the odds? Okay, so Scudder got me into this new game. Oh, yeah. So we've been playing this new game. It's called Wordscapes. It's uh, it's like a cross crossword puzzle, but you have to make up the make up words to fit into this crossword puzzle. And you only get a certain amount of words. No sponsorship, by the way. It, yeah, none. Um, it, it's very addicting, very aggravating, uh, and very fun. It's like this. No, don't. Why? Because I don't want to have to ask, do copyright stuff. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, either way, it's... Yeah, ignore that. Um, yeah, it's very, very fun. So, um, I do hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff, and I will see you guys in the next one. Oh, that guy made an illegal turn. Alright, see you guys in the next one. Peace.